Incomplete triangle PQR. PQ is 15.5. QR is QR is 10.5. Okay, QR is 10.5. So find the possible value of QRP. So angle R. So we wanted to find angle R. So you see here. If you want to find angle R. Mungkin dah main tempat lain. So, wajib ni. Sign rule. Ni dia ni. So, angle QRP. So, to use sign rule. So, first need to have opposite set. And then second need to have opposite of what we want. Now we want to find theta. So we need to have the opposite which is rule number 2. Yes, we have which is 15.5. Opposite set. So we have 30, 35 degree and 10.5. So we can use sine rule. So here to find theta, sine theta over opposite is 15.5 is equal to sine 35 over 10.5. So, sine theta is equal to sine 35 over 10.5 times 15.5 which is equal to 0.8467. So, theta is equal to sine inverse 0.8467 which is equal to 57.86 degree. But you see here. Sekejap mana you kan. But you see here, we have this angle and we have this side 15.5. And you can see 10.5 is smaller than 15.5. So, they might be ambiguous case. So, theta is either here or maybe here. So, it can be either two. So, if theta is here, theta is lower than 90 degree. But then, if theta is here, which is equal to 180 minus theta, which is equal to 180 minus 57.86, which is equal to One two two point one four degree. So we have lama. So we have two triangle. So the first one with the uh, theta lower than ninety, and second one is the theta hundred twenty two point one four. So we just draw. so first triangle. So we have here. Theta is 57.86 and then here we have 35 degree and then this one is 15.5 and then we have 10.5. So we see here to use sine rule we must have opposite side. So we see here we have this one. So we wanted to find here which is R. So we have to find so, to use sine rule, we must have opposite set. So, opposite set. Uh, so, we have two opposite set. You see here, 15.5 and 57.86. And then, we have 35 and 10.5 here. And opposite of what we want. Now, we have we wanted to find this one, length PR. PR. But then, we don't have the angle here. So, we need to have the opposite of what we want. Now, we need to find angle. So, angle theta is equal to 180 minus 35 minus 57.86 which is equal to 180 180 minus 35 minus 57.86 which is equal to 87.14 now we have the opposite side now we can take any 
Now we can take any of the side that we want. Either we want to take uh, 35 and 10.5 or 57.86 and 15.5. Um, okay. Opposite side and opposite of what we want. Equal to PR over angle here. Angle 87.14. So for example, if I take, I just take this one, P. So we wanted to find R. R. We wanted to find PR. PR over angle opposite is sine 87.14 is equal to so i just take any of the opposite so i just take here 10.5 over sine 35 so pr is equal to pr is equal to 10.5 over sine 35 times sine 87.14 so we get 18.283 So, length, the first length is 18.283 Now, we need to find the second one So, see this one, the shorter So, here the shorter one So, we have here, here and somewhere around here maybe Alright, so this one is 10.5. This one is theta, 122.14. And this one is 35. This one is 15.5. So again, to find here, this one is PR. We need to have the opposite of what we want. Now we need to find the angle here. So theta is equal to 180 minus Minus 35 minus 122.14 which is equal to 180 minus 35 minus 122.14 which is equal to 22.86 Now we have theta angle So to use sign either we have opposite side We have we need to have opposite side and opposite of what we want lah Opposite side you can use either one so I just take, okay, let me take this one. 122.14 with 15.5. So we wanted to find PR. So PR over sine 22.86 is equal to, so here is 15.5 divided by sine. 122.14 So PR is equal to 15.5 over sin 122.14 times sin 22.86 which is equal to 7.1112 cm So another one is 7.1112 cm So we have two line of PR which is